What's up guys? So if you've been watching the St. Lawrence Stage 5 Bass Pro Tour Tournament at all this week, you've seen a lot of this. I'm sure you know what it is. By this point, it's called a flogger. It's an amazing tool. It's, it's funny because we keep talking about technology, technology, technology. Like we went way back in time and, and, and dumbed things down with the use of this, but it's an amazing tool for seeing in the water in clear water. Um, you know, I've been using something like this for probably 10, 12 years. What we used to do is we would take a five gallon bucket, cut the bottom out of it, uh, get, get a round you know, piece of plexiglass and silicone it in. And that worked really, really well. When this thing came out, it was a little bit better built for what we're actually doing. But we use it to find bed fish. Uh, we use it to just to see what's down on the bottom. The whole key is you need clear water. I mean, it, it, you could use this thing with two, three foot visibility. And you're not going to see anything. To me, if you've got six foot or better visibility, it really helps. And, and one of the other things is you've got to get almost on top of the fish. So you've got to be able to, you know, be in deep enough water where you can get over the fish and it's not going to spook them. But it's a good tool to use for, for actually catching bed fish and also just finding them. Sometimes, you know, if it's a windy day, you can just go through an area, stick this thing in the water and just look and see what's going on down there. See what kind of bait fish there are, see what kind of, how many fish are in an area, what the bottom composition is like. Really, really cool. Um, I would say probably the last thing with this is, uh, you know, it's, it's, it's something that I might go a whole year without using. It spends a lot more time in the garage, but when, when you do have an opportunity to use it, it's such a difference maker and we're seeing it big time this week. Uh, you know, but it, it's pretty cool. Check this thing out. It's called the flogger. There's a lot of different variations of it, but a lot of us are using it this week.